this video i'm gonna show you five steps you need to follow on your pc in order to boost your fps fix fps drops and lag in woodering wave on your pc so guys welcome to my channel if this is your first time here please subscribe drop a like on this video and without wasting any time let's dive straight into our this video so guys in the very first step we are going to disable the power throttling of our gpu and also disable all the background running application the folder press windows r together from your keyboard you will find out here this is running window simply type here gpedit.msc and hit ok now go for computer configuration administrative template windows component and go for app privacy folder inside you will find out let's window app run in the background open up this file and from here you need to enable this option after that go for default for all app and set it on force deny for disabling all the background running applications now hit apply and click ok now you need to go back and now this time open up to some folder now you need to scroll down and find out here power management folder so go inside it inside you will find out power throttling setting so go inside it now here you will find out turn off power throttling so double tap and open up power throttling settings now you need to enable the settings on your pc for turning off the power throttling of your pc on your windows 10 or 11 now hit apply click ok and save the settings on your pc now the next step we are going to optimize our Woodring Wave game directory settings so for that go for your file explorer go for drive and install your that specific game if you have installed it using the epic game so go for program file open up epic game folder go for Woodring Wave now go for Woodring Wave folder inside you will find out here xg file of your Woodring Wave.xg file simply right click here go for properties of your this file go for compatibility and now check mark on disable full screen optimization go for change high dpa settings and also check mark on override high dpa scaling behavior hit ok hit apply click ok and save the settings in your woodring wave now close out it now you need to right click on your desktop go for display settings now scroll all the way down go for graphic settings of your windows now go for default settings and click on change the default graphic settings make sure to turn on the hardware excellent gp scheduling because this will reduce latency and improve your pc performance then turn on variable refresh rate and turn on optimization for windows game now once you're done i need to go back now go for browse option again open up directory of your woodring game open up woodring game folder add here this exe file click on the add button now go for option and set it on high performance now hit save and close out your windows settings if you have installed woodring game using the epic games launcher so go into the settings of your epic games now scroll down and make sure to turn off desktop notifications so uncheck these boxes after that now you need to scroll all the way down and there you will find out the woodring wave so click on the drop down now you need to go for additional command line argument and simply use here this command that is minus land play minus no splash minus no texture streaming and minus use all available port this is the best command for improving your fps and other one for the textures and for your network so guys once you follow the settings now go for library section and there you will find out your woodring game now you need to go for three doors go for manage option and if you are having any kind of freezing crashing in your woodring game guys make sure to verify your game and that will fix that problem so guys now the next step we are going to optimize our woodring game power plan settings so for that go for your windows search search for power and there you will find our choose power plan settings in your control panel so open up the settings there you will find a lot of power plan on your pc or laptop and the best one for the gaming that is the high performance so guys click on the drop down and there you will find out this high performance power plan now you need to go for change plan settings now here we will change some advanced power settings so go inside it Go for hard disk, go for turn off hard disk and set it on 0 minute. After that scroll down, go for processor power management, click on the drop down, set it on minimum processor state and set it on maximum processor state. Once it's done, now hit apply, click ok and close out power plan settings. Now in the final and the last step of this video, I'm gonna show you how to disable the HPED that is also causing more CPU usage and causing the stutters and lag in Wuthering games. So for that guys, you need to go for your Windows Start icon or go for Windows Search and search for Device Manager. But guys, right click on your Windows Start icon and there you will find the Device Manager. So go inside it. Now you need to scroll down and find our System Devices option. Click on the drop down or scroll down and there you will find out high precision event timer this is causing high cp usage that cause stutters and lag on your pc so guys here is the high precision event timer right click here and disable this device on your pc 
Once you're done, now you need to close out device manager and now you need to one time install your PC. Therefore, all the changes take effect after that. Launch your PC and launch the Woodring game and enjoy the best performance out of your any low end or high end PC. I hope you love it. Please make sure to drop a like on this video, subscribe to my channel, and see you again in the next video.